In this video, we're going to take a look at setting the initial test scope in Burp Suite. By default, Burp will log all HTTP or WebSocket messages for further analysis. Setting a scope allows you to tell Burp which URLs you do and don't want to test. For example, you might want to exclude URLs you don't have permission to test, or URLs that aren't safe to test as they might contain dangerous functionality, or simply that they're not relevant and you want to reduce the noise and concentrate on what's important. To add a URL to your scope, go to Scope Settings via the Target tab or the Main Settings. In the Target Scope section, under Include in Scope, click on Add and specify the prefix for the URLs you want to match. When you choose OK, you'll be asked whether you want to stop logging out of scope traffic. You can alter this option later if you change your mind. For now, we're going to disable it, as this can provide performance benefits. After you've added a URL to your scope, you may want to exclude specific paths that are a subset of the in-scope prefixes. For example, you may want to exclude an admin page from your tests. To do this, in the Target Scope setting, under Exclude from Scope, click on Add. And now you're ready to start testing.